Canadian non-profit organization built from within the Canadian Muslim community. NCCM is a leading voice for Muslim civic engagement and the promotion of human rights. Please welcome Steven! Hello everybody. Salut tout le monde. Salam alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Seiko. Today I'm talking to you here, but I also want to make sure that I'm talking to the other 40 million Canadians across the country. Yes. It is such an honor and privilege to be here with you all because on this historic day, we join Canadians from across the country of all walks of life that have gathered together to call on their government with a message of peace and justice that will resonate around the world. We need peace and we need it now. As we speak, as we speak, the Palestinian people of Gaza are again enduring immense suffering, victims of a conflict that stretches back to a time before most of us were even born. The situation is dire. More than 11,000 people have died, most of them women and children. Thousands more are trapped under rubble. And millions are suffering in the dark through what can only be described as a medieval style siege. Men and women trapped in the world's largest open-air prison, deprived of food, deprived of water, and living in terror of the bombs. Living in terror of the bombs falling over their heads, wondering when it will be their turn to join the loved ones that they have already lost. For us, as all Canadians, this is anathema. Because to be Canadian is to believe in peace and prosperity, to believe in human rights, to believe that all people, regardless of who they are or where they come from, deserve dignity and respect. Yes. For us as Canadians, it is right that makes might and not the other way around. Woo! And that is precisely why that for so many of us, the actions of our government have been so disheartening. We're watching war crimes being perpetrated against def defensive civilians on TV, live. And what is our government doing? Yeah, our government went on TV and repeated condemned and repeatedly condemned acts of terrorism and it calls for an immediate release of the hostages and unpeded access to humanitarian aid into Gaza. And they should. But that alone is not enough to prevent the death of thousands upon thousands of children and the torture of millions of people. And aid calls for humanitarian pauses. That's not going to do it either. Are we going to pat ourselves on the back while we ask for a couple of hours where the murder stops? Monsieur le Premier Ministre, Mr. Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. Shame! We are here today to say loudly and clearly that Canadians want a ceasefire and they want a yeah. ceasefire now. Ceasefire now. Ceasefire now. Ceasefire now. Ceasefire now. Many of us have spent a lot of time talking to politicians and leaders and we have heard their expressions of concern time and time again. But let's be frank, concern is not enough. It is time for action. It is time to join those who are working and calling for peace. People like the Burnaby City Council, 
who called for a ceasefire last Monday. Give it up to the Burnaby City Council. People like the mayor of Toronto who on Friday stood up and asked for a ceasefire. Finally. This is what Canadians want to see from our leaders. And all of us here, we are all committed to helping our leaders give Canadians exactly what they want, which is what? Ceasefire now! 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 The polls are in. The polls are in. The polls are in, and the vast majority of Canadians are tired of war, they're tired of death, they're tired of destruction, and they are tired of the social discord and the cost that war brings. Now is the time for action. Now is the time for democracy. Now is the time for Canada to get out there on the international stage and put its weight behind its values. Values like respect for human rights, values like respect for international law, and respect for the will of its citizens. We are Canadians. We want a ceasefire, and we want it now. Ceasefire now! Thank you so much, everybody. Merci beaucoup. Salam alaikum wa rahmatullah. Cheese fire!